what's going on everybody another movie another ride home review and uh, this time around I went and saw the movie life directed by Daniel Espinosa uh, starring Ryan Reynolds um, Jake Gyllenhaal and Rebecca Endridge and the story is about um, uh, some scientists slash astronauts on the International Space Station uh, get one of uh, their probes that brought some samples back from Mars and within one of those samples uh, tended to uh, there happened to be a life form that decided to assert itself shall you say what I liked about this movie um, I thought the cast was great. The acting was superb, uh, and well, and the cast was well directed. I mean, and uh, um, the intensity was there, the pacing was there for the movie. Um, yeah, all in all, I mean, the visual effects, the visual effects were great. The the way they made the alien look and move, it looked so real, um, or Martian, or however you want to put it. Uh, so top notch. Technically, um, I, I have nothing to take away from from that. Now, what I didn't like was the fact that this was just another rehashed uh, be afraid of the unknown, be afraid of foreign objects type thing, um, be afraid of the alien, that type deal. And it was an obvious ploy by... Uh, Sony Pictures to get a movie out that's similar to Alien, which is uh, coming out here in May. Um, and in fact, you know, I saw a slight critique about this movie that said it's a cross between Alien and Gravity. I would, I would, I would second that. Um, it just, I mean, even though the acting was good, the intensity was there. Uh, There's parts that you were you know, at the edge of your seat, and, um, I mean, I, I can't take away from the talent that was there, but, you know, it really, it really wasn't anything new, it, you know, it didn't really bring anything uh, to the forefront, they added a little bit more science than what Alien did, um, so maybe you could throw in a little bit of the Martian as part of this whole plan. Um, so, so there you have it, really. Um, it was okay. It was good. There was a lot of uh, technically and all that. Like I said, you can't take away from anything. I mean, they did the job. It's just the story was just mm, okay. Well, whatever. So, um, but if you saw it, what did you think? Uh, one of the things I. I uh, one of the things to watch for is, uh, um, you know, how Jake Gyllenhaal brings up not wanting, not liking to be on Earth. Um, uh, that little scene, yeah. And, I mean, the character development was a little lacking, but I mean, they really got right into it, and so try to delve the characters from there. But and the ending, predictable predictable um so so what did you think if you saw it i mean did it wow you did you see some things that you didn't think did it did it uh surpass your expectations well, let me know um and if you like this let me know that let's just leave a comment whatever and uh, share this with your friends let, let me know what you think about uh, life um so next week I'll be back at it. This time I'll be watching. I think I'm going to break down and watch Ghost in the Shell. And why am I saying break down and watching Ghost in the Shell? I will leave that for next week. So I hope you enjoy these. Uh, stay tuned next week. And uh, also stay tuned to more of these ride home reviews because there's going to be some really cool stuff coming in the future. So I will talk to you soon. Have a good week. Bye.